Hi, my name is Henny van der Wald. Uh, I'm with Marion Roberts Metal on the Orem project. Uh, we had a situation here where we've got a Lieber tower crane um, that's motor burned out, um, which is the crane uh, in my back here. Um, the motor burned out and had to be replaced. What we would normally do is we would erect the mobile crane up and we would uh, lift the motor up and put a new one on. Uh, in this case we couldn't do it because it, it would take us uh, four weeks to uh, do the planning and to get, get, to get the necessary permits and so on in order. So we came up with the idea to get, uh, to get it done by rope access. Um, our health and safety manager on site, Darius Fulyun, uh, and I came up with the idea to get RAI in. Hi, my name is Tarion Oryk. I'm a rope access supervisor from RAI. We were contacted by Marion Roberts to remove and reinstall the primary hoist motor of one of their cranes. We provided them with a solution using rope access technicians to safely lift and lower the motor to the ground. For our setup, we basically uh, put PPE anchors into the ground, so we drilled them in, we load tested them, we set up the winch, we set up the first lines, uh, we got our guys up, we set up our tension lines on releasable rope grabs so that we wouldn't overload them. We did the same with all our hauling lines and everything was backed up. Look, basically we on this side we're very limited, we've got some structural issues. Um, so having a mobile crane on this job here, as you can see at the back side, that's our level 7. Um, structurally we can't put a mobile crane there. Uh, if we need, if we have to get a mobile crane, it will either be in the road, um, which will also be a problem using it. We have to get a traffic permit, which might take up to four weeks. Um, so basically we, we had one option left which left us with rope access um, and that was also the safest option. Okay, some of the things we ran into were mostly the headroom, uh, not having high points to rig our ropes. Uh, we rigged up some staging to try and get us some higher points to rig off and it seemed to help us quite a bit. The hoist motor of the, of the tower crane burned out so we actually need to get the motor from the backside behind the counterweights. We need to get it to the front side, just behind the cabin, and then get it onto level eight, um, which is just the top level above level seven there, um, onto level eight. By rigging it down, um, and then obviously getting the new motor onto level eight, moving it to the rigging point, moving it from level eight back onto the crane, horizontally back to its position, bolt it down, and then, uh, yeah, then our crane's fixed. Uh, they told us the motor was roughly 250, it was more around 300, just over 300. Um, so we just had to change our rigging and just use the load saw as much as we could. Fortunately, they were able to have the crane back on by the next working day. So we're quite happy we could help. <laughs>